Elia. Hoisted to Dombrandt at the back, and here goes Kerr, and Dombrandt's riding side saddle on his shoulder. Back to Kerr, majestic, brilliant Harlequins right at the start. 78 seconds, Saracens punctured. I mean, it might be instinct for a vision, but the pure quality and the execution of the skill is absolutely world class. On we go, Smith sensing space. Shegan will try to fill it, but look at Elia out there all on his own. And Shegan rather ragdolled, and Elia did well to get it away. Chisholm, and then the ball inside to Merlin. Merlin scores. And then look at this, when it goes back to Marcus Smith, it's him that sees Elia, Elia, all on his own outside. Now, does he put a foot in touch? No problem there. Wonderful offload over the top, and it's a great try from Harlequins. Matt Gallagher, busy clocking up the miles in the absence of the likes of Alex Good, Liam Williams, Elliot Daly. Smith, oh, he's gone again, my <laughs> goodness, he's gone again. The ringmaster, Lasiki, the bowling ball, back to the ringmaster, a run for the line, and Murley will score. Quinn's up to at the moment. There we go. I'm going to go that way. Goes round the corner, pointing his way. The CK, just check on that pass. Look flat. No problem to Murley. And he's over. Line, Quinn's the line. All the way through for Clark. Four. What about the likes of Kapoko and maybe Barrington? Still not quite. No. Dombrand leading the defensive no. effort. Ten, your miles off. Advantage. And now Kapoku again. Still can't quite get there. Wigglesworth, perhaps now time to engage the backs. And it is, and it's a try for Lazowski. Finally, finally, Saracens with a foot on the ladder. Saracens have got such bulk, so many big players. And eventually, it's one of the slightly smaller players. Look, Lazowski. Cock was set up to go short, and Wigglesworth missed them out, and Jackson Ray, and Lazowski's able to roll his way over. Smith has a look the other way, Penny. A kick that uh, had nowhere near the power on it, but I think Quinns have got away with it. Ricochet back in their direction. Smith again, Imatoye chasing it, there's some room behind, and oh, it needs to come across. Gallagher's there, Imatoye has it, and he scores. Greasy ball, wet surface, a little bit of Harlequin's fortune, and maybe a fourth and bonus point try. Definite try. Yeah, he just wants to check the coming together of Ibatoi. It's a decent challenge. They both slid at it for the right time. He's collected it, put the ball down. That's the fourth and the bonus point. Yep. So an attacking line out for Elia. They go short to Dombrandt. Oh, it's just sprayed out the back. He, he's got it again. Pops it up, and the try scored by Paul Asike. Smart play. Bit of innovation from Quinns, but look at this. Pops out the back. Callum Clark's already committed to stopping the drive. Yeah. All the Saracens players got their heads down. Yeah. And it's a great try. Kapoku not far away. Just wonder if there's some space out here if they decide to ship it. They've got the penalty. Quinn's defence looked like it's narrowed a bit. Don Morris looks interested. Spencer might now use him. Over the top to Morris and Morris scores. Really good build up work from the forwards. And then another and lovely way to pass from Manu Vunapola. Could have been a number of players that scored there, yeah, but a very that. decent finish. Landaku. Harlequins have brought on another test player to be to Thavon Party, the Fijian. Smith, who's had his own impressive game. Oh, that's given away! And Landaco, who's barely had time to say hola, scores a try. Lovely little kick from Marcus Smith again, just causing that doubt and confusion and Saracens in their desire just to push the ball a little bit, throwing everything at it. Once more, Austin Croft, but Simmons has been strong defensively. 
however, at the end of a week that Mark McCall called the toughest of the season so far, this will be tough to swallow. Saracen's biggest Premiership defeat for four years, and at the hands of Harlequins, who haven't enjoyed themselves as much so far this season.